welcome back to another vedic math tutorial hello friends i am sunish from team must and in this video i'm going to tell you about the square calculating of square of a number using vedic math most probably we're going to use a method a function named duplex method so before getting into examples let me tell you about the function duplex method what it actually says so so duplex function for a single variable is a square for two variables it's 2ab similarly for three variables it's 2ac plus b square uh, an easy way to remember is for extreme you use 2ac and for the middle one it's b square and for four variables it's 2ad the extreme ones and the middle ones plus 2bc similarly for fifth sixth and so on so it's not a big deal so you have to just remember these as you have uh, we're going to use all this uh, all these in our examples so it would be more clear when i'll tell you uh, solving examples so let's start with examples now suppose the number we have to find the square of a number 4 so let's start very from very basics so 4 square as in this case we are, we're going to use the duplex function for a single variable so in this case there is a single variable 4 so i'll write on 4 square so it's 4 square is 16 so this is the answer not a big deal now let's take another example this time a two digit number suppose the number is 24 in this case there are two digits so uh, you have to remember you uh, this pattern see i'm starting with a single digit 4 So write down the four square is sixteen because duplex also of a single variable is a square. So in this case a is four, or let it be b. It's b square. So four square is sixteen. Now two variables for the duplex function for two variables is two ab. So in this case two cross two is four. Four cross four is sixteen. Again. Now we started with a single single bar. and we'll end it with a single bar we have to remember this pattern we're going to follow this pattern all through uh, calculating all the number squares so so in this case 2 is a single so duplex for a single is square just the square so 2 2 cross 2 is 4 so this comes out now we'll write uh, we'll just write down a single digit for every space what i mean is i'll write down 6 here now one was carry now one carried to 16 makes it 17 so i'll write on 7 and one again carry so one carried again and added back to 4 it gives me 5 so this is the answer let's take another example uh, again with the two digit number suppose the number is 48 now again as we'll starting with the single digit the duplex function of a single digit is square of that number so 8 square is 64 write down as it is now for two digit so duplex function for two digit is 2ab so 2 cross 4 cross 8 so 2 cross 4 is 8 8 cross 8 is again 64 coincidence huh now again we started with a single bar we will end it with a single bar So duplex function for a single digit was the square of that digit. So four square is sixteen. So this is it. Now again, let's just and uh, evaluate it. So sixty-four, four, and six carried gives me sixty-four plus six gives me seventy. Seven carry. So sixteen plus seven gives me twenty-one. So this is the answer. Mm, sorry, sixteen uh, plus seven carry is twenty-three, not twenty-one. So I'll just correct it down. So forty-eight square is two three zero four. Now let's take another example. This time with the three-digit number. Let's say it's two thirty-one. Any number you can take it. So starting it from the very. Uh, so starting in the single bar. So. One square is one. Now double bar. For two numbers, we use the function two ab. So in this case, two cross three cross one gives me six. Now for the three digit, 
now for three variables it was 2ac plus b square in this case a is 2 b is 3 and c is 1 so 2 ac what well, uh, let me write on this way 2 cross 2 cross 1 so this is 2 ac plus the b square which is 3 square in this case it is 9 now calculating for the double bar two variables so for two variables it was just 2 ab so 2 cross 2 cross 3 so 2 cross 2 is 4 4 cross 3 is 12 now ending with a single variable as it started so 2 square is 4 so this is it now let's just evaluate is, uh, this uh, first let me evaluate this part this was 2 cross 2 is 4 4 cross 1 is 4 4 plus 9 is 13 so I'll just write on 13 here now let's just evaluate the whole so 1 so 6 now 13 3 and 1 carry carried to the 12 so 12 plus 1 13 again 1 carried so 1 carried to 4 is give me it gives me 5 so this is the answer this the square of the number 2 3 1 is 5 3 3 6 1 uh, this might seem to confuse you a bit but uh, do practice it for twice thrice and um, I assure you it's gonna be on your tips also it was analyzed that while calculating a square of a number using this Vedic math trick save 70 percent I mean it's it takes just 70 percent lesser time as compared to just multiplying the number 231 cross 231 so Vedic math is always the best option in case you want to see you want to see all our Vedic math tutorials you can just uh, see uh, see the description of this video uh, we have provided with all the tutorial links also you can subscribe to our channel team must as there are a lot more videos coming on Till then, be must and keep rocking. See you in the next video soon. Bye-bye.